and I, I love the sage. And there's a real, real sense of community downstairs, and especially over this weekend since we had the, you know, the festival, the Maracona festival. There's been lots of things happening, and um, it's just been fantastic. This has got to be the the leading Americana festival in the country. It was exhilarating. Oh, I felt very appreciated, and, and they knew a lot of the songs, if not all of them. It's my first time here, and I'm really impressed with the building and what they've put on here. It's just been fantastic so far. The Sage Gateshead is unbelievable. It's so well put together. The sound is great. The, the vibe is good. Programming is great. I mean, I like all kinds of music, and there's always something for everybody. Hey, I feel like it's very cool and uh, very enjoying. Uh, I like this view. Lovely, yeah. Really like it, yeah. Seems really cultured. Um, the waterfront looks great. It's really nice. Because my wife liked the, the trip up the river and I liked the music, so we combined the two. Modern, new, and uh, it's right beside the town. I think it's just a beautiful building. I think it would be this, this big, and there's a lot on. It's now the Americana Festival, so a lot going on at the same time. It's nice and light. <laughs> Um, I've heard the acoustics are really good. Ain't gonna, gonna let no, nobody, gonna turn me. Ain't gonna, gonna let no, nobody, gonna turn me. There's something for everybody and, and, and I think come here, it's a really good community resource. I'm here mainly to see Otis Gibbs, also to have some family. And I think there's a lot more to be found here than there is just in the headlining act. and I'm looking forward to hearing bands that I've never heard before actually and discovering some new things to get passionate about. Um, I've been watching the outdoor stage this afternoon um, and people were thoroughly enjoying that. And the live venues outside, which is brilliant. And it's, it's on your doorstep, it's local. We don't have to go to the other big cities. We don't have to go to London. It's in the North East, and that's what I love about it. You want to find somebody that you've never heard before, somebody whose album you want to go out and buy, somebody that you want to go and see play again, somebody that you want to see who's influenced them so you can find more music. But there's something about story songs that really kind of resonate with people and have that kind of horrible poetry really and I think you know kind of whiskey heartbreak death love these are things that you know affect everyone in a just sort of universal songs really a lot of you know the Kentucky vibe and yeah a lot of the cowboy hats and yeah we hear a lot of American country music so it's, it's different it's very different hearing it here Absolutely brilliant. I mean, it's a superb festival. Um, it would be it would be nice to, to see it grow. I mean, if it possibly can, but it is it is really a superb weekend. And they say you got to play there. That's all you need to hear. Finding a place that's really dedicated, really organized, really well put together. There's nothing like it. Well, the, the whole festival is amazing, number one, but the, this room is particularly wonderful. The acoustics oh are gorgeous. Amazing. Yeah, really, really great. You get fantastic people, you get an eclectic mix of music. The big names come to the Northeast and 
we get the chance to see them and they're fantastic. Roseanne Cash, just brilliant, excellent.